Tiger Day. This is the Phoenix from Phoenix Rising Towers. Back to do a weekly reading for the sign of Capricorn. <clears throat> this is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with all of you, but for the ones that it does resonate with, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. For the ones that it doesn't resonate with, please check your moon, rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Those videos may resonate with you better. I must say thank you to the sign of Capricorn because you all have been the ones with the most views for the last two weeks. If you all would like to have a personal reading with me, you'll have to check the description box below. Okay, so let's see what is happening with Capricorn this week. On the bottom of the deck, we have the Justice card in reverse. Sorry. So we have the Two of Wands in reverse. We have the Death card upright. We have the Queen of Cups. So some of you are dealing with a water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Six of Pentacles. And the justice in reverse. Okay, so for some of you, you all have decided to let the change that is about to happen in your life happen without fighting it. For some of you, you all are finally deciding to accept love into your life or give love to somebody. And for whatever situation these are, you all are going to be having equal partnership. It will be a equal give and take situation and for others of you you all just refuse to make the decision to have the transformation and you all are fighting it so the more you all fight it and don't decide to move forward is the more stuck you all are going to feel okay two of wands in reverse that's too many cards for it. Hmm. Okay, so, the devil in reverse. So, somebody is dealing with a Capricorn, or this could be you, Capricorn, making a decision about your own self and deciding to accept whatever change is coming. For some of you, you are in, addic in, in an addictive relationship. Codependency is a major factor in your relationship. <clears throat> For some of you, you all are now coming out of the Five of Cups energy, crying over spilled milk or looking at things that is gone and not being appreciative of what is. Hmm. Somebody is having a brand new passionate beginning this week. Or it could be a fire sign coming towards you. I don't know. Clarify the dead card. For some of you, you are dealing with a Scorpio. Some of you are not trusting your intuition when it comes to change. You all are... For some of you, you all are accepting that change is coming, but you all are not trusting yourself and your intuition as regards to which decision is best for you when it comes to change. Okay. Some of you refuse to walk away from whatever situation this is. And for some of you, you all are holding something close to your chest. You all are keeping some secret. Probably you're hiding from your family that some kind of secret is happening. But the dead card is about transformation. It's about a lot of feelings and emotions and stuff like that. So... For some of you, Spirit is saying to you this week, trust that everything is going to work out in your favor. Ooh. Okay. So we have the Queen of Wands. Clarifying the Queen of Cups. Oh, sorry, the King of Wands. Clarifying the Queen of Cups. 
So, like I said, some of you are dealing with a fire sign. This person is coming to you passionately. And offering you love. Two of Cups. This could be a soulmate coming towards you. For some of you, you all are feeling stuck because you all are feeling that nobody's coming towards you, nobody's offering you love, nobody cares about you. Clarify the three of ones. Yeah. Some of you have just. cut off. You're not trying to be in a relationship, you don't want to be with anybody, you're just. So, or you're looking for some kind of answers and yeah some of you have sleepless nights about whatever situation is this five five six of pentacles for the sign of capricorn Yeah, the Empress. For some of you, you all could be receiving news this week that you all are pregnant. Wouldn't be for all of you, but it would be for a few of you. For others of you, you all are stepping into this Empress energy and is going for what you want. And making sure that you have positive thinking to get through with it. Yeah. Some of you feel like you don't have the financial independence that you are seeking, so you all are about to probably start school. Some of you are going to be going for a new job in which you will be successful. But some of you, it's a third party situation. Clarify the three of cups. Clarify the three of cups for the sign of Capricorn for the week 22nd to the 28th. Okay. Two cards came out. Okay. Some of you, you all are constantly defending yourself probably about being accused of being in a third party relationship. For others of you, you all are feeling like this relationship is going nowhere. For some of you, it's a Libra you are dealing with, and this person just has you tied up, like not making a decision, not knowing where they stand, not knowing where you stand, wondering what is happening. Clarify the justice card and reverse for the sign of Capricorn for the week 22nd to the 28th. Okay, some of you that felt betrayed, this person, you felt like this person betrayed you, you're coming out of your head about it and you're finally accepting it for what it is and moving on. For some of you, you're building a wall and not letting anybody in. Okay, three cards came out, Knight of Swords, Eight of Swords. King of Pentacles. For some of you, you're dealing with an earth sign. This is an earth sign that is coming towards you. Or this could be you, Capricorn. This could be you standing within your own power, knowing that you have everything materially that you want and there is nothing that you lack. Some kind, somebody is rushing into you this week with some kind of message. And you have been up in your head a lot lately, Capricorn. And this is what it is, is keeping you blinded towards whatever the situation is. Because it's the star card at the bottom of the deck in reverse. So this is not your wish fulfillment. So Capricorn, for this week, some of you are going to have a passionate new beginning if you decide to stop looking at the past. So, that is it for you guys. 